What's a poppin' Pisces? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker, baby. Join me as I read you. You all size. We about to see what's going down now. I got a old, my old nasty love deck, baby. I hope you guys are motherfucking ready. If your ass is sensitive, go on and click the fuck on off, baby. Because I will be talking about your partner, your person, your shoulda, woulda, couldas, have nots, maybes, possiblys, whatever the case may be. If your ass is sensitive now, I didn't said this twice, go on and click the fuck on off, baby. Right here, right now. So you guys better be lighting up with your girls, smoking up, toking up, drinking up, kicking your Piscean bunions up. Okay? So without further ado... Before I get to coughing and choking and chewing on ice and shit. Which I said I wasn't going to be chewing on too much ice now. But. But. There's always a but. Remy. But. I don't know what's about to come out of my mouth. We are, we already got secret lovers. I told you this old nasty deck now. So get your ass prepared. Let's see what's going down for all of my Pisces spirit. Go on and pull on up. You must sage the cards for all of my Piscean gods, baby. Okay, now listen. When I was writing this deck, I'm like, oh shit, I'm about to tell all kind of life stories. I don't care if you ain't having sex, if you uh, celibate, okay, whatever the case may be. It's all going to come into fruition. Okay. All right, Pisces. So listen, I done slapped this wig down and put my clown makeup on, bitch. Y'all better be riding for your girl. <laughs> Y'all better be riding this motherfucking wave. Do you hear me? So listen. Don't get mad at me. Because it's the truth. Let me get my drink on out the way before I get to talking a whole bunch. Let me get my root burr. Now, I want to say a special thank you to those who have donated to my channel. Those who just hit that motherfucking subscribe button, my OG triple O motherfucking G's. I'm grateful of each and every single one of you guys. Those who get personal readings as well, too. I'm grateful that uh, your girl can even be in your life to do what I do best. So, thank you. Cheers to that. All right. Now that that's on out the way, check your ADHD at the door, baby, because I don't know what's about to come out now. And I got a feeling somebody's going to be like, well, that's not for me. This reading's not for me, bitch. So what? All right. We already got other people involved. Okay. Somebody who's extremely selfish. Okay. You might just be selfish. Now, story time come out. Y'all know what time it is. Okay, bitch, get to rolling. I put the cards down, get to rolling. Now, it all pertains, okay? Just don't need no trick-ass comments. Give it to me for my Pisces. This is my first time actually shuffling these. I just seen strap-on, too. All right. We have red light. Ooh, and also flirt. Right underneath that is wig slip. <laughs> ah, now listen, your girl knows all about it. Okay, somebody think that it's held down by some glue and some uh, chin straps or whatever the fuck. Okay, the front of 360 is making all kinds of uh, changes and adjustments and shit. All right. I know all about it, bitch. I know about uh, laying the lace glue and not putting no glue on that motherfucker. Like I said, the chin straps or whatever's holding that motherfucker down. The bobby pins. We have play at. Uh oh, play on player. Mm -hmm. Jack off hour. Now, let me go ahead and break this motherfucker down. You hear me? Bitch, ain't no reason in even fucking with nobody else. 
Ain't no reason to fucking with another body where you could just be to yourself. Okay, that's that feeling when you get so high and so horny. And you're like, well, I'm just going to take an hour to go handle my business. Okay. Might be right before the kids come to school. And just be making me think about the community coffee and the community teas and all that shit that people be touching on. Don't be wiping their hand. They be having a jack off our hands. I be thinking about that when I go get my Starbucks. And when I go get my ice. Just better off doing it alone. We got Sneaky Link. What's this about, Spirit? We have Tribe. This could be three different people and drunk. Drinking fuck. Okay, so somebody might be drunk than a motherfucker. Now, I can smell that. Just like people can smell my weed, I can smell people's breath with their alcohol. Okay, bitch, know how to mask that shit. Know how to make it smell like cleaner. Give it to me for my Pisces. You got squirt. Oh. So maybe somebody is trying to get stuck. You got dirty text in here coming up. And also voyeur. So they watching. All right, they might have some secret thing going on with watching with this voyeur. Give it to me for my Pisces. We got girth. Oh, and one nice stand. Okay, so it looked like to me the whole world watching her. Could have been dealing with somebody that you just needed to have a one night stand with. Okay, whether you're in a relationship or you single or not. Okay, situationships in between. Because sometimes, even when I'm in a relationship, I'll be thinking on the in between. You know, and it'd be my maturity thinking about it. Like, oh, if this nigga got one foot out the door, I'm about to have one foot out the door too. We're going to be far, few far and in between together. Okay. This could be running out of love or questioning what it is that you do love her. Give me some more for my Pisces, but the one night stands. So it only needed to happen one time. We got a whole bath. Oh, bitch. Could be dealing with a possible accordion energy here. Give me some more for my Pisces. Little dick energy. Oh. Oh, and hickey. Okay, so you ain't got to have no little one to give off that energy. You could have, what it, uh, what's they call it, uh, Neapolitan, uh, what's the, uh, syndrome called? Could just be a small person. Okay, Napoleon complex. Acting all big and high and mighty like you can do certain things, but you really, uh, limits I guess that would be the word give it to me for my Pisces romantic what the fuck paddle whips and change and also experience at the bottom of the deck tell my Pisces what's coming up next and I'll elaborate on this shit with some cards tell my Pisces what's coming up next spit also worth the wait. Oh. Six nine and on film. Uh-oh. Bitch ain't done that in a long time. So something is being caught on film. You also have a confession coming up. So they want to confess something to you. I'm also getting something about the scent or something like that. Now, as I'm thinking about this, I'm thinking about the card that I, uh, 
It's another card that I need to write. And I'm going to remember, you got to get checked after this dirty motherfucker. What's the confession about, spirit? Get to the point and eat ass. <laughs> Oh my god, y'all know I did it. Yes, I did. Now, I don't care if it come on the reverse side of things, okay? You heard me say it. You could be kissing ass. Okay, secret lovers here once again, and also strange fetish. And cuddle and caress. Give me some more for my Pisces. What's <laughs> <laughs> oh my god uh, okay now listen sometimes you might get a little booty hair stuck on your tongue you know certain things that might not uh, we have sex as a weapon that we might not um, you know remember somebody's entangled or something like that or the porn star here and sex as a weapon Hey, this is why I be flagging my channel. Like, Laurel, I cannot believe that you would say such, such things. Yep, I said it, nigga. Eating ass. Okay. And also experience and bussy talk. Okay. So somebody could be horny for you. You got date and sex. So... You got some sort of foreplay coming up, but it's giving the vibe of somebody is like, you turned off. Okay, I'm also seeing clear licking as well. But child, yes, is that is what it says. And it also says computer love. Give me one more. Ophelia, it says olfactophilia. Okay, so this is something about somebody's scent or the way that they smell, the aromas, this, the uh, 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 the actual scent. I was talking to um, uh, this guy and I was telling him, you know, it's the reason why people want to smoke and it's the reason why people want to, uh, it's a magical thing first and foremost because you got oils, smells, scents. The elements that come together that make the sense, whether it be making an actual oil from the flower. Um, but I was telling him, I'm like, shit, that's the reason why I be wanting to smoke is to inhale and to smell different types of flowers and tobacco and uh, and weed that's being burnt. Lavender, all that shit. I figured out why I like to smoke. We got inbox, so somebody about to be in your inbox, baby. Okay, they, they cannot resist some sort of urges here. Okay, also what you gonna do about it. So let's get some let's get some cards. Get my favorite deck. Alright, here we go. Somebody can't control their urges for you. Okay, you also might be bobbing and weaving this motherfucker, but we have drive to you. And pillow talking. Eat, feet, and stomp. What's this about, spirit? Give me the energies Pisces needs to know about. Eating that. Eating this ass. Or what was that Snooky Snookyana song? Or Sukiana? Okay, somebody want that rim. Give it to me for my Pisces. What do they need to know about? Coming up next. And love. This is Love Pisces, by the way. Don't forget it. 
All right, Ace of Swords, also Two of Pentacles. Somebody's definitely juggling. That's probably why they're not able to reach out. Seven of Sword energy here. Something about your inkling or something about your intuition is very significant. About someone being a sneaky fucking liar or a sneaky link or something like that. Okay, or somebody had some sneaky behaviors around you where they were tiptoeing. Okay, trying to steal time. Could be dealing with a possible Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Give me what's happening next, spirit. Because we already know this is the energy we not fucking with, okay? That this is the never again. I'm so shocked that that card ain't even come out. Ten of Wands here. So something about a mood, but somebody's heartbroken over you with the Three of Swords and also five of cups so they feel like they missed out on an opportunity that could be at, in actual pain or just agony give it to me for my Pisces what do they need to know about spirit the emperor so they getting their life they're trying to get their life together but I feel like somebody is fucking up here definitely could be a third party situation that they were disappointed in or Somebody knows that you know. What's this three of swords, five of cups, and emperor in reverse here for a spirit? All right, temperance energy. So somebody been around the world and I, yeah, yeah. Could be dealing with a Sagittarian energy, or this could be like the opposite of Sag. Possible Gemini. I'm getting opposites or something like that. Pisces with a Virgo, that type of thing. Which makes me question, like, is it actual attraction? Or what you attract? Because in each person, it's every single, it's different scenarios that turn out differently. Whether you keep them as a friend, fuck buddy. Somebody go to another relationship thinking that they can find you and multiple energies wrapped up into one. Or somebody that's wanting to have something for a lifetime. Whatever the outcomes may be. You got the devil energy here and also nine of swords. So they could be worried about being tied or some sort of soul ties here. Or somebody's extremely toxic could be having sex, drugs, and rocking and rolling together. What's behind this? Knight of Pentacles could be a distance or some sort of distance between you two. But I'm feeling like somebody's having nightmares because they didn't uh, fulfill some sort of request. Give it to me for my Pisces spirit. What do they need to know about this Nine of Swords, Three of Swords, and Devil? Shit, this is a lot I'm saying right now. Six of Cup energy here. Okay, so somebody's here from the past, or this could be somebody who wanted to make some new memories. Could go either way. Then you have the Queen of Pentacles, so this could be definitely you all about your motherfucking coin, your bag. Okay, getting to the money, making new money, old money. This could be a new job or um, some sort of new position that you're more concerned about but you do have the tower energy here so something is chaotic okay somebody could be kicked out or it could be um having to distance themselves because something is extremely toxic here now i don't know if it's over on their end or your end or what High Priestess at the bottom of the deck. Okay, it could be a disaster that you watching, that you seeing happen. Give it to me for my Pisces. What do we need to know about coming up? All right, Knight of Wands here. Okay, Ten of Swords, something was stopped. Something has ended. Okay, but I feel like um, King of Swords here, Ten of Swords, something had to be over. They couldn't make an action or there's some sort of action that they 
were too dumb to make. So they feel like they've made a lot of uh, foolish mistakes. All right, what's this about? Somebody could be really heartbroken or they feel like it's some sort of betrayal that's surrounding this person. What's this tower and ten of swords here for? The sun. Okay, so clarity, truth, clarity, honesty. Okay, getting your, uh, how Stella got her groove back. Okay, you know the truth about it. Ten of, ten of cups here. What's this about, Spirit? Some of you guys could be uh, financially focused as well or focusing on your family. Um, I'm getting something about um, erogenous zones as well. Okay, Page of Wands, also Lover's Energy and Eight of Wands here. So somebody's having to love someone at a distance. Could be possible Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Like I said, some of y'all could have taken y'all power back, got y'all love back. Being selfish. Bitch, this is mine. Give it to me for my Pisces spirit. What's coming up next? they need to know about okay eight of pentacles and five of swords also three of pentacles so i'm getting either a marriage here okay or some sort of disconnect when it comes to a marriage you also have you just working on some things okay this could be new collaborations new beginnings okay this also could be a new job doing things with precision taking your time Maybe that's why it said worth the wait. Okay, give it to me then for my Pisces. Because, honey, listen, I'll tell you the old Pisces, baby. Let me tell you something, baby. You get the uh, unevolved or the evolved Pisces. Page of Swords energy here. So they got their eyes on you. That's that voyeur. Okay, they peeking, looking. What's behind this shit? Four of Cups. So you could have been withdrawn from this situation or just all together, like I said, some sort of disconnect. Not that man scratching his ass. Okay, here we go. The Empress. Sit on your throne, baby. You got a lot of options. Okay, coming to you. Some of y'all just might be selecting some things off of the menu. But I feel like somebody tried to um, give you so many options to where they tried to blindside you with the dis or just distract you with the background shit. Okay, with a whole bunch of breadcrumbs. Give it to me for my Pisces. You also have the Three of Wands and the Magician here. So yeah, I feel like they tried to distract you or they feel played with that play yet. All right, also Five of Wands and the Hangman. And Two of Wands, Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So, Ace of Cups here. I don't know, this motherfucker a little weirdo. Maybe that's why Strange Fetish came out. But you got the King of Cups and the King of Wands both here together. So, it looks like to me, there's something new getting ready to come into your life or somebody wants to renew or have some sort of offer of love. Now, y'all know I'd be like, bitch, where? Where, nigga? Okay, even if you are in a relationship. Because it'd be some people who be... They'd be in a, like, in a zone of, like... If you knew them on the street, they, they come off as single. But back behind the scenes, they got somebody else. Okay, but that is a fantasy here. Somebody is, is thinking about you in that type of way. Seven of Cups. All right, so I'm going to get this other deck. But like I said, they got some sort of urges. Maybe they could be upset. You might be online dating or something like that. Or for some of you guys, you just 
know when to hold them and know when to fold and plan A, plan B type shit. The ancestors got your back. Something is coming along, though. Okay, you got bussy talk and other people involved. Okay, also computer love here. And love. Pillow talking and smother. Oh, shit, bitch. Okay, it's some sort of new experience that's getting ready to come up. I keep seeing strap on, so somebody need to get that shit out the dishwasher <laughs> and wash that motherfucker off. It's coming, but confession. Let's clarify the confession and the urges because they can't control it. Star energy here and also seven of pentacles, so they heavily thinking about it. Now, I shuffled the fuck out of these cards last uh, this morning. So y'all gonna get it all. Give it to me for my Pisces. What do they need to know about? What's this confession and urges about spirit? You got justice. Could be dealing with a possible Libra. Also seductive here. Give it to me for my Pisces spirit. Informant. What's the information about with this confession? Perfect timing. Also, smoke some weed and sit on back by choice and bounce thine ass. Oh, you got freeze here. Big money. I just seen big money and pick up. Salty and pepper. Yeah, so they could be really salty. American Psycho here. Worldwide coming out and dodge the bullet. Okay, also sneak dissing and sight. What's the confession? So you're about to hear an actual confession. Okay, talk to you early morning. Sex shooter. And again and again. Also high tech spine and buzzy bob. Now it's too many buzzies that came out and going motherfucking crazy. All right, mission complete here. Sleep. So you're going to hear this shit out the horse's mouth. Okay, whatever this is. And this big money is her, baby. Talking to me in your sleep. Booked and busy. Okay, and want what you got. What's pipe? What they want? What these bitches want from my nigga? Count. Talk to you. So a lot of confessions, a lot of things being said. You also have Lone Wolf. And Worldwide, once again. All right, so somebody could be traveling or there could be something that's at a distance. I'm also getting something, somebody that's uh, extremely athletic or um, something dealing with nature or the, or the elements here. We have Eat the Cakes and Sight. Okay, so they're going to be confessing to you that little war story. Something is protecting you from this energy. Okay, because it could be a karmatic lesson. You have love, Jones, and throne of gold. So it's definitely worth the wait when you just sit on your throne. But they have a serious fetish or fantasy of looking you up or uh, liking things to be prolonged here. Give it to me, like I said, a whole bunch of bread crumbing. You have new chapter. Lights, camera, action, and recharge. Also, YouTube land coming out. And new love. Okay, and tricky. So, yeah, bitch. Listen. They got some sort of plans for you. Somebody new coming your direction. Like I said earlier. Also, location and gravity. Now, whatever this devil was here for, the she-devil is coming out. Okay, and shopping. So, I don't know if you're shopping for something new or... He or she, masculine or feminine, bitch, whatever. Okay, both of them is her. The devil's is out to play. Okay, but they about to confess a lot to you or uh, want to speak something into existence, but you have sight. So maybe that's why they lurking and keeping heavy surveillance on you. Okay, watching your Facebook, Instagram, whatever is in technology, child. Okay.
All right, Pisces, I love you guys all so much. Let me know what you all think in the comments down below. Make sure you guys get nosy and check the description box as well so you can get your personal reading from your girl. Now, I am so grateful once again, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.